If you are elected and you learned that the government knew aliens had visited Earth and the public didn't know, would you want the public, would you sure the public found out? Well, it, it depends on uh, what these aliens were like um, and whether they were Democrats or Republicans. I think it's time to open the books uh, on, on uh, questions that have remained in the dark, on the, on the question of, of government investigations of, of UFOs. It's time to find out what, what the truth really is that's out there. Uh, we ought to do it really because it's right. We ought to do it because... The American people, quite frankly, can handle the truth. The situation in Yemen poses a threat the to the world, according to U.S. Secretary of State Hillary Clinton. Instability in Yemen is a threat to regional stability and even global stability. Clinton spoke at a news conference after meeting with Qatar's Prime Minister Hamid bin Jazam Jabbar El Thani, who called for a diplomatic solution in Yemen. And we think that the situation in Yemen, uh, there is only one solution to be solved through a peaceful manner by trying to find a way to solve this problem in a, in a peaceful way. Al-Qaeda in the Arabian Peninsula, the Yemen branch of Osama bin Laden's network, claimed responsibility for the December 25th attempt to blow up a U.S. passenger plane. It said the attempt was retaliation for U.S. involvement in Yemen and its support for the government's offensive against the militants. On the streets in the capital city of Sana'a, residents are worried about the militants. They are committing the biggest crimes through sabotage, dishonoring people, and killing innocent souls. They are the criminals. If the United States Air Force did recover alien bodies, they didn't tell me about it either. And I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. Okay, well, there you have it. I want to know. Directly from the president. I want to know, too. It is now 1-5-2010. I was uh, wrong on my disclosure for Christmas and disclosure for uh, New Year's, so I'll be the first one to say I was wrong, and Happy New Year to everybody. But it doesn't mean that disclosure still isn't happening, because it definitely is happening, and I kind of put that beginning stuff up there so you could see that high-ranking officials are actually talking about it and have been talking about it for a long time. Um... Presidents are not allowed this information. They haven't been for a long, ever since it was opened. They're always denied access because it's illegally compartmentalized. They're secret operations. Um, They're always kept away from presidential and congressional oversight. So nobody has control over it. You know, just the people who set it up, basically. So um, you have to understand that behind the scenes, there's a war going on between a war and then a war and another war and another war behind the scenes that we don't know about. There's P-51 
people that want this to happen and there's people that don't want this to happen and the people that don't want it to happen will go by any means that they can to make sure that it doesn't happen because when it does we're all going to be able to learn our true history and also have access to the types of technologies that this world can actually bring us because there's not any reason whatsoever that one person in the world should be starving so there's enough food to go around there's enough energy to go around and once that comes out UFO disclosure comes out those those technologies will come along with it and that means people that have money and power will lose their money and lose their power so people are probably going to die before that happens so uh, we have to keep our minds together and keep our selves positive and and know what they're doing to us and just be aware that uh, we know we know about the fluoride in your water we know about the chemtrails in the air we know about everything that you're trying to do but it's not going to work so if everyone stays positive stays together we can see ourselves into ascension as one so we will uh, wait and see what happens and uh, Hopefully this Stargate will do as it's said to do, and you can look it up. The uh, Yemen Stargate is something that's for real, and you can also look up uh, the MJ-12 papers that are, <coughs> uh, the MJ-12 files that are helping to suppress UFO disclosure. So we'll stay together on this, and uh, hopefully next time we uh, talk it'll be in a better, better time, better place. So... Have a good one.